Good morning, everybody. Mike Vaki, PrincetonTrader.com, here with your Tuesday market webcast. Okay, daily chart. Um, there's a slight consolidation going on. We spent most of the day hovering in and around 2900 to 2904. They dipped it down. Uh, they did as low as 2889 in Globex. They whipped it back through. But the new weekly pivot. Uh, 2893 and change held a support. Uh, it's held its support since 6 p.m. on Sunday. There have been a couple of attempts below, but those attempts have been rejected. Yesterday was all about taking it down to the weekly pivot a couple of times and defending it and having it head higher. Well, one of the last things I said to my subscribers before we left, we had a long setup uh, against uh, 2904. And I was not really willing to look at the short side much because heading into Wednesday on a shortened week, they'd had every opportunity since Sunday night to take out that weekly pivot. They couldn't do it. Um, so absent a big piece of news, those happen all the time, but absent a big piece of news, I didn't really think it was likely that we were going to go back down there. And absent that big piece of news, we may not be back there for the rest of the week. Um, so you see it's it's made a higher high versus yesterday. It's taken out the 50. It's traded as high as 29 and 36 quarter in the overnight. Let's look at the hourly. Um, when I, when, when, when I uh, screenshotted this for my subscribers last night, this candle had been put in. It said it was lifting out of a small consolidation. And, you know, what you have here is expansion. So um, it had been knocking around uh, uh, Sunday, certainly through yesterday. A lot of chop in and around uh, 2900 to 2904, and you know, up we go. Friday's high, 2946 half. That has got to be taken out by the bulls. Not necessarily today, but in the next day or two, uh, they have to print higher highs um, week over week if they're going to continue to push the issue back up towards areas like 2961. Um, 2980, 3000 over the course of the month. Um, you see weekly pivot here at 2893 half. We opened there Sunday night. We made an attempt yesterday, I'm sorry, uh, Monday uh, during uh, Labor Day to take it out. They couldn't do it. They held it, closed above it. Yesterday, we were down um, uh, once in the early morning to 94 quarter. Then, the real rejected move was at 10 a.m. They took it down to 28.91, which is great short for us. I rejected it back up and over. It held, and now it's just built up. It's just built off of that. There's only so many chances you get at the weekly pivot early in the week, especially if you're the Bears. Once you lose it, going over 29.46 half is pretty much going to put that weekly pivot to bed until uh, until a new one comes into play Sunday Monday. So for uh, for us in the room, the long setup was last night, went out over the trade alerts. We do everything on Slack now. It's so much smoother. It's, it's, all it's on all devices. It's instantaneous. It's, it's, it's all in one spot on one app. It's fantastic. So that goes out. We walked through the trades. Uh, it took a couple, you know, it took a couple, uh, couple of re-entries to get it done. They didn't want people in it. They churned it. You can see it. Uh, for about three hours here between uh, 2907 and uh, 2902. But once it got going, um, you know, around nine o'clock, then um, that was that. So they chopped everybody up and then they lifted out of that consolidation. So um, we've taken profit. We've got a runner left. I've got a 20 handle stop on the runner. Um, so the day is over before it starts. And the week was over yesterday. Um, uh, between the Globex trades and the trades in the regular session. It's been a really nice start for, uh, for September. Everybody have a fantastic day. Let me say off the open, 28 to 30 is going to be key. It's an area I expect to be tested. And if they're, if they're going to put in a morning dip, if they're going to put us in a significant morning dip, um, keep your eye on, I think, I think that hourly mid band, um, uh, at 17 might be too deep. I think a better candidate for that 
is volume weighted average price, which is right now 24 and change. So off the open, look for 24. If it holds, it can lift and go. All right, everybody have a fantastic day. There'll be more stuff out on social. Come check out the room. We'd love to meet you. Trade them well. I'll talk to you soon. Follow us over on Twitter, Instagram, and Snapchat, at Princeton Trader. Check us out on Facebook, and join us for a free trial at www.princetontrader.com. Trade them well.